What is up ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new video. Today we got something new. We got a clip with every single gun in the game. Um, this idea was brought up by Jelly, one of my moderators, and the idea pretty much is to hit a clip with every single gun in the game. Standards uh, depend on what gun I'm using. Um, for instance, like the, the Tommy gun, I, I got like, I think like a, a 10 man or something. But uh, with the Model 8, I got like a 5 man, so really it's whatever gun I'm using, uh, I just want to get a cool moment with it. All clips are hit on grind within 4 days. Um, but yeah, I had to cut the clips short, um, so I no, cut most of the this? times I just cut the reactions out. That's why I'm doing kind of a commentary right now. Um, but I think the video is still 28 minutes long. If you want to just see a certain category, like if you just like to see all the sniper clips, I put a timer on nice. screen right now. If you want to go to the also class, the medic class right very now, nice. it's actually playing uh, support class or whatever class you want to see really or this particular nice. gun, it's in the class. Nice. Uh, you can see this time on the screen <laughs> right now. Um, so yeah, I'm going to nice kind clip. of commentate the clips. Sometimes I show the reactions if they're on it in time. Uh, but I didn't want to make this video too long, even though it's still 28 minutes long. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. Be sure to drop a like if you enjoy it. Took a lot of work to do. Um, also, let me know in the comments what your top three clips is. Um, I'll let them know in the comments as well what my top three clips is. And um, yeah, let's get right into the video. Uh, with, with a couple of flanks, like with the MP28 and... Um, Depends what kind of gun it was, the Suomi, all the 50 bullet medic guns, I just wanted to hit like at least 8 man or a quick 7 man. I wanted to hit like quick clips, that was uh, kind of the point with it. I have some longer streaks, uh, with the EMP, which, which is a 30 round mag, I wanted to just get a quick 6 man. It's all about kind of getting a clip class, I, didn't, I don't have any streak that's longer than 40 seconds I believe. Um, so yeah, I also put all the DLC guy. weapons, all the weapons are in order. Um, so, uh, after the Tommy gun you get a couple of the, the, well, the DLC, the guns that were released later, it's not called the DLC, but you know what I mean. <laughs> um, so yeah, here we got the MP20-34, uh, uh, which was actually quite a difficult weapon to hit a clip with. I think I had this off stream, I had a clip um, on stream, but I wasn't too satisfied with it. So, um, yeah, I wanted to make this video really good, so I hit some clips off stream. So here we got like an 8 man. And here, one of my favorite clips in this video is with the Thompson, and you will see in a second why. Um, I didn't put it in slow motion, but uh, you might want to have to <laughs> here in a second. Okay, I... Uh, six. Yeah, it was definitely one of my favorite clips. The six-man spray with, I think, 39 bullets it was. Uh, all hip fire. It was really nice. No one had a clue what was going on. It was quite sick. Uh, here we're going to see K-Clip, which uh, is one of my favorite as well. Um, not because of the ZK itself, but uh, I went on a four-man spray with the revolver afterwards. Yeah, four-man headshot spray. The last one didn't pop up on the kill feed. Uh, or it did pop on the kill feed, but then show the skull because it was a headshot. You can see right here, one headshot, two and watch this headshot. Was a headshot didn't pop on the... Holy the crap! Skull. That was kind of sick! Alright, so um, here we got the Carmine Snipers on the Medic class. Um, I pretty much just wanted to hit the 5 men with it, uh, like I did with all the um, uh, Recon Snipers. Nier got a pretty clean headshot to end it off with. It was quite a nice clip. Pretty happy about it. And this one is probably my cleanest clip, especially with the second headshot right here was pretty clean. I was really happy to hit this. Um, all the medic snipers were surprisingly easy to hit clips with.
All right, now we got the last medic gun, the Type 100. Um, it was surprisingly the hardest gun out of the medic class to hit a clip with. Uh, I don't know why, I was just struggling with it, getting really unlucky. Um, it was quite a frustrating weapon to hit a clip with, because uh, I feel like the time to kill is quite slow on it. Um, especially on grind, I, I was struggling to get three kills with one mag. I probably just had to be more accurate, but <laughs> it was not working out for me. And then uh, eventually, out of nowhere, I just went off with it, as you can see right here. Uh, probably my longest clips in this uh, episode. Um, but yeah, out of nowhere, I just went off. It was a struggle to hit a clip with this um, gun uh, compared to the uh, MP34, which actually went quite easy. Um, not the best meta gun as well, but um, yeah, I quite like the Type 100, but for grind, it was, I don't know, it was not working out for me. Now we're on to the recon class and we're starting off with probably the, one of the best clips I did uh, with the Lee Enfield Iron Sights. Hit this off stream. Um, I had a five man on, um, on Twisted Steel, wasn't too happy with it and then eventually I just hit this. Really clean seven man headshot with only one miss. Um, then this was one of the hardest guns to get a clip with, uh, so I took what I could get here, which was the five man. Still quite quick um, and very aggressive. I was kind of happy with how aggressive I got this clip on the rudder dam and with this pretty dirty turn on right there, and then I finished off with a pretty easy kill. Is that the model eight? I think it doesn't get much better than that, does it? I got the 95, uh, probably one of the most accurate clips with a kill for the smoke. And of course I miss a shot right when I say that, and another one. But uh, afterwards it gets pretty clean here. Got a couple of nice shots. We got the ZH, uh, not my best clip, a little bit campy in a way, um, but yeah, I was quite happy to take this one. The, the semi-automatic snipers were definitely not the easiest ones to get uh, a club with. I think I got a six man here. I took a five man to, to lease but with the clip um, for the standards. Is this a ZH so, clip? Um, I was quite happy to get a six man right here. That has to be it, right? Now, Craig Jurgensen, my cleanest clip, maybe after the Lee Enfield, but I got a six man right here with like clean headshots. Kind of clueless enemies for sure, but I was really happy to hit this. Six headshots. <gasps> Let's go. That was freaking clean. I don't know how. RC, probably my least favorite gun in the entire game, uh, besides all the MMGs and the, the bipod snipers. I really, I don't know why, but I just, I don't like this gun. It's not bad at all, but it, I don't like it. The only thing I like about it is how it looks with the gold skin and the chrome uh, three times scope. This, is, this has got to be the RSC clip, right? Has to be. Yeah, it has to be. Let's go. Here we got the car 98k. Uh, first, I took a really nice foreman, and then the uh, life right after. I was like, okay, I got the clip, but I'm gonna try to hit something better. And then I hit a nice five man with a collat right here, starting off with a collat. And I really like the last shot for some reason. It's a nice flick on the last dude. Or drag shot right here. This is probably maybe my least favorite clip, but uh, it was definitely not an easy gun to hit a clip with because the reload was so awfully slow. Um, so I got a foreman here and then I switched to the model 27 to get a headshot and then a really nice headshot right after. Oh, 
Raza MK3, maybe um, one of my nicest clips with this turn on here. And then I just went on a quite that nice uh, clip on the, um, on Operation Underground. It's pretty clean, I was happy with the shots. Five headshots in a row. Now switching over to the bypass snipers, uh, trying to clip with the boys AT, and yeah, I just went on the flank on some clueless enemies, uh, which I needed for this, because the rate of fire is extremely slow, so um, yeah, I was just kind of <laughs> waiting for a server where like people didn't know what they were doing, and uh, I guess I found it. I got the PO8. Um, not my proudest clip. I think I could have hit something better with this, uh, but I just took this uh, six man right here. Didn't really enjoy playing with this because I think the trench carbine is just so much better. Uh, so I didn't play with the PO8 at all that much. Um, but this is what I could get out of it. Still, uh, still nice six man. Not really on the spectacular spot, <laughs> but uh, I took what I could get. Now with one of my favorite guns to probably use in grind, uh, the Trench Carbine, it's such a good gun, um, has 41 bullets I believe, and it's perfect for flanks, putting a spawn beacon behind the enemies, and I uh, got this 8 man here, I hit much better clips with the Trench Carbine though, but um, I didn't want to use it for this video. Switching over to the support class, uh, probably the worst clip out of the support class with the K7. Um, not really a good gun to hit clips with and it only holds 25 bullets and holy crap my aim was trashed there. <laughs> um, but yeah I took this clip, um, all the other clips are a lot better with every other gun. Probably the worst clip out of the support class. Now here are the first MMG clip. The MMG clips were extremely easy to hit. Uh, I think I hit all MMGs in maybe uh, not, Come well it was not the first try already. every time, but I hit them within 5 minutes of switching to MMGs. Um, except for the, the last MMG, that one took a little bit longer. Or the, the VGO, not the Is very last uh, MMG. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Pass this dude. Now to the 12G, probably the one of the best clips in this uh, in this episode. Just watch the last uh, kill. It was not one. It was it was a triple collab to end it with. Went on a nice streak here. Got a couple of kills, and then right here got a hit mark, and there you go, a triple collab to end it with.
go. There you go. There you freaking go. There you go. Let's go. Oh, nice. We got the brand. That's the brand. Lewis gun, probably one of the best guns to use in grind if you're on insane flanks. This gun can hold over 90 bullets and it works perfectly. I think I got this first try to switch into the Lewis. Went with the AA side some devastation and I got a nice 7 nice or 8 Lewis. flank. Check. M30 drilling on left station was quite nice. I was hoping to hit something a little better than this, uh, but I got a collateral to a single there. And then almost hit another collateral there. Uh, sadly, was a hit mark on the second boot. And then I finished off with one more kill. That was almost back to back collateral. Did you see that? FG42, also a very nice clip, uh, got 4 kills here with the first mag of 20 bullets and then I went to an, in another 4 men. Once again, clue the enemy, so got lucky there for sure. Kind of working? Oh shit, dude! Here we got the MD42, again, very easy to hit a clip with this one. Got 2 kills here. Then I run up the stairs yeah, and I dude. went, um, I went mad with the gun. I still have, I thought Insane I wasted all my bullets. And Brian. Definitely overpowered though. Oh. <laughs> it's oh, quite okay. nice, didn't even have to use the bipod here. Uh, which I kind of wanted to try to do, I definitely want to try to get a little bit more an aggressive clip with this one. I knew it was possible. Well, nice, we got that clip, I don't have to play with this anymore. <laughs> Should we just get all MMGs done right now? Here with the PGO, the MG I struggled the most with until I randomly got on this spot where I was not expecting to hit anything on and uh, I hit a 7 man. Onto the shotgun, um, a little bit of a longer clip, but I uh, got pretty lucky with the upstairs. Um, there was a smoke place where I could um, luckily get some more reloading in, because that was kind of the challenge with this gun to uh, keep on reloading, because I definitely didn't want to just hit a five man. Shotguns on the, um, on the ground were pretty overpowered. Then I went lucky with the smoke, was able to reload and got another three kills. Let's go, there is a better shotgun clip. No, there were some. 26, not my uh, my proudest clip. We got a six men here. Uh, at least I got uh, definitely one of the hardest guns to, uh, to hit a clip with uh, because of the 20 round mech. So um, I was happy with the six men. I definitely think I could have hit something better if I tried a little bit longer. Uh, five men right what's there. not an easy uh, gun to use on Brian? Six. Nice. The match in here, a little bit of a longer clip on Devastation. I went on a little bit more of a streak. Um, a pretty good gun for grind, surprisingly. You can hold a lot of mag. The um, down part of it is that the mag is kind of in your sights. Um, definitely not a very aggressive weapon, but if you can keep your distance, you can drop enemies pretty quickly. Definitely an underrated weapon, for sure. So the clip with the Chatson. Now, um, maybe I I don't like this clip even worse than the K7. 
Uh, just a five man. I was uh, I was not liking this gun here. Uh, I was trying to play aggressive with it because in the bipod it just took too long with 30 bullets and you have to reload every time, so I didn't like it. And here to the last MMG clip, a really nice one. What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? That was all for the for the support class. Um, now we're on to the uh, assault class. Uh, one of the better clips are definitely in the assault class here. Uh, here with the Sturm grew a little bit of a longer streak but had some nice accuracy in it and then I went on a really nice flank. Still can be something. Oh yeah, that's still something. Oh yes, there we go. That's the storm. Onto the M1A1. I actually used the iron sights. Normally I would use the times 3 but for grind it was working way better with the iron sights because it just has a little bit of a faster ADS time. I managed to hit this nice 7 man here on death station. Onto the M1907, uh, one of the harder guns to hit a clip with, this gun is very good, uh, but to hit longer clips with it's quite tough, because you want to get the, the kills fast, because otherwise the clip is not really uh, nice to watch. Um, so yeah, I took this 6 man, it was an 8 man overall, but it was a, a quick 6 man at the end that I did it for the clip. Um, but yeah, it was definitely not an easy gun to, to actually hit the clip with, um, because you can't get like 2 kills with 1 mag. Uh, three of your very accurate, but it was quite tough to hit one. Onto the SCG-44, I feel like I could have hit something better than I hit here today um, on Operation Underground, but um, I took the clip, it was still a nice spray, uh, a little bit of a longer streak and cleared most of the, um, the upper section on the B flag. Um, but I think I could have done more with this gun because I know the SCG-44 has a lot of potential to hit good clips with. Um, I still took this clip though, it's still nice, uh, but I think I could have hit something better. Now with the self ladder, 1916, um, a really nice flank on Twisted Steel. Um, not an easy gun, because you're not really going to win many gunfights with it, because the rate of fire is so uh, slow. But if you're on the flank, you can keep on going with 26 bullets, and every 3 kills, uh, or 3 shots, you can get a kill. It was very nice to use once you were on that flank, as you can see right here in this clip. This always helps. Oh, let's get that donor challenge. Now on to what might be surprisingly the, the hardest gun to hit a club with for me. I was not having this gun. I was maybe getting very unlucky or whatever. I just I just took the six man. Um, and it took a long time with it. So probably the longest time out of all the guns that were in the game. Uh, so I took the six man, not not a very impressive clip, but um, yeah, definitely the worst clip. Uh, I had to hit something.
With the Mass 44 I really like the beginning part. I don't know, it was very accurate, clean movement. And then later on I just went on the easy streak on the enemies that were a little bit close. But I, uh, I like this beginning part. A little bit of a longer streak compared to the other ones. Now on to the last clip with the M1 Grand, um, again not very uh, much the bad clip but uh, I took what I could get with a little 3 man with um, dynamite there and then I went on uh, I think a 5 man in total with the M1 Grand. It's just hard to hit a clip with this because it only holds 8 bullets, um, definitely not a bad gun to use, maybe it's not that suitable for grind. Um, but yeah, I was uh, I was just taking this clip. I think it was a six man actually in total. I got two, then I got two singles, and then another two men and one uh, mag or clip, I should say. Um, definitely not a bad gun, but very hard to hit a clip with. So yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Please be sure to leave a like if you did. Um, also leave your top three clips uh, from the entire episode. Um, in the comments, I'll do it as well what my top three favorite clips was. Um, so yeah, that's gonna be it. It was over 50 guns. Uh, I might try this again later on in uh, the lifespan of Battle 5 when there are more guns available. Uh, maybe with the next week of grind or something. Um, so yeah, really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching if you made it till the end. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye.